All righty. All righty. Glad you can make it today. We're going to be attempting some super basic yoga for beginners like myself. Uh, today, just uh, in, enjoy the moment. Do your best. Clear your mind. Focus on your breathing and if anything does pop in your head, think positive. Okay. Okay. Have an open mind today and like I said, give it your best. Okay. First thing we're gonna do is go ahead and sit down, crisscross applesauce. Okay. And anything we do today, make sure you focus on your breathing, relax your muscles, have good posture. This is called the easy pose. I'm going to put my hands here and do a couple of breaths. My shoulder is going to come up and back. I'm taking deep breaths. Now I'm going to slowly move my neck nice and easy. Side to side, maybe forward and back. Now, this moment, close your eyes and think about keeping your head above your heart, right above your pelvis or hip. And just take some deep breaths. Just sit here and take some deep breaths. I like to breathe in my nose and out through my mouth. Exhale. Try to see how much air you can breathe in. And hold it in. And then slowly let it out. Doing great, class. Now, I'm going to draw our palms together at our heart. And think about lifting forward to your thumbs. And keep breathing. Straighten that lower back. Make sure you're not hunching. Keep that heart over your hips and just practice breathing at this spot right here. You can relax your elbows. Make sure you relax your legs too. I have a tense to tense up. Try not to let any muscle get tense. Just breathe and relax. Clear your mind. Now, interlace your fingertips. Palms forward, you're gonna go up and back and just stay here. Now, deep breath and exhale and release your fingertips back here. Interlace, push out and slowly up. Breathe in and now keep those shoulders back. And repeat, you know, Lisa. Breathe in. And keep it back. Now, take this hand, cross to your knee. Take this hand and put it to your other hip. And work on that posture. And we'll breathe right here. Slowly turn a little bit. But don't twist so much, it's uncomfortable. You still want to be relaxed. For me, it's only a little bit. For some of you might be able to turn even further. Big breath. And gently release back to center. 
And now, take this hand to this knee. Find that other hip. Now try not to round forward with your back. Keep that straight and slowly just turn. Okay, you don't want to round forward. They have a tendency to do that. Keep that posture straight. Keep that heart over your hips, over your pelvis. And let's breathe right here. All right. Chant release, come back to center. All right, interlace those fingers. Palms reach forward. All the way up. Take a deep breath in. And push them back. And exhale. Now, put your palms here. And relax your legs. Push forward. Now, I'm going to go to my fingertips. I'm going to take one arm up. I'm going to go all the way up. And take a breath. Now, let's do it again. All the way up. But now we're going to take it over. I'm, I'm only going about this far. Try to round out the back. Try to keep that back straight. And slowly come over. Now, you can go forward, back here. I'm going to stay on my fingertips because I'm a beginner. And so we come down. Now, let's go the other way. And you go forward and back a little here. Pulse back and forth. And come back to center. Stay here and breathe a few times. I gotta add someone in the weight room. One second class. Okay, now we're gonna trans. Go ahead and put your knees and your hands. We're gonna. Right out your palms. Start bend your elbows. Take a breath. And slowly come up. And go ahead and relax those feet. Keep those flat. Just hold it here for a second. And we're in tabletop. Try to get that back straight. Mine's a little rounded. Let's see if I can straighten it out. There we go. And I'm just going to take a couple breaths here. And I'm going to lift my head up and down. Up and down. Now bend the elbows down. And push up. Make sure you're breathing. One more breath. Okay. Now slowly lift your head, hold it here. Now slowly round the back. And we're going to go into cat pose. Hold it here. Now my back is rounded. Take the head off. Tuck that chin in. And let's breathe right here. Nice deep breath. As you breathe out, go back here. Tuck in. Arch your back a little bit. And we're going to go cat cow back and forth. Okay. One couple more. Back in the cat. 
and stay here at tabletop. Try to get your back flat. Mine's a little rounded. Now, you're gonna bring your feet in. And we're gonna sit right here. You can either stay here, or if you wanna walk your palms up. Try to get that back straight. And we're gonna do a couple wrist rolls. Keep breathing though. A couple more. Okay, now go back to all fours. Now I'm gonna extend my back leg back. My knee is still on the ground. And I'm just gonna pulse with my left foot back and forth a little bit. Work on keeping that back straight. You might feel a slight stretch in that calf muscle. I'm just going to rock back and forth. Try to keep that core tight and breathe. Okay, back to tabletop. And now let's go the other foot. Straight back. Max off my mat a little bit. Scoot up a little bit so you can see it. There you go. Now try to keep a nice line from the heel to your head. Mine's almost there. Couple more. Okay, now back to tabletop. Now walk your hands forward and walk your knees back a little bit. And we're gonna try to get our forearms on the ground and tuck your head down. And we're trying to get our heart to the earth, heart to earth pose. And breathe. You find it's a little too hard in your shoulders, just walk your hands back a little bit. Try to keep your elbows straight in line with your wrist and your shoulders. Now, tuck your feet in. Press up. I'm going to bring one leg in. Now we're going to go into what we call a downward dog. And you're just going to switch which foot tries to get flat. Push back with your hands a little bit. And remember, relax and breathe. And don't worry if you can't get your feet flat. As you notice, mine aren't. Just do your best. These are called pedals. Just pedal your feet back and forth. Take a breath. Back to your knees. Walk your hands back. A couple wrist rolls. Keep that back straight. All right, we're going to go back in. Here we go. Uh, this time I'll hold it here. And I'm going to try to get both feet flat to the best of my ability. Make sure you relax that neck. It's only really been a knee at a time. As you do, make sure you're breathing. Okay, walk up. And now I'm on my feet. We're in a forward fold pose. 
and just hang here and breathe. If your knees bend, that's okay. Now bend your elbows and just rock side to side. Now hook your thumbs behind you. Keep that head down and slowly raise up. Oof. One second. All right, a couple of breaths here. Try to keep that heart, your head over your heart and your heart over your hips. Now, bring that sternum to your thumbs. And remember, head over heart, heart over head pelvis and keep those hips right over your heels. So a nice straight line. And we'll sit here and breathe. Now we're gonna breathe in and interlace your fingers. And bring them back and slowly exhale. All right, thumbs to sternum, interlace, push out, breathe in. And slowly exhale. Interlace, push out, breathe in, all the way back, breathe out. Now do a couple of neck rolls, side to side. Going slow, always need to work with your neck, nice and easy. You keep that posture, keep that head over your heart. Heart over your hips and those hips over your heels. Okay, slowly bend the knees, reach up, and we call this volcano pose. And reach as high as you can. Your arms get a little tired, that's okay. Make sure you breathe, do not hold your breath. Spread those fingertips as wide as you can. And hold it here. Now grab your left wrist. Hold it like this. And I'm slowly just gonna go gentle pull and lean over. Now let's go back to center. Now I'm gonna grab the other wrist and slowly stretch. Back to the volcano. And so we exhale. Let's sit here and breathe. Okay, now we're going to take our right foot forward. Take my left foot back. Now make sure your feet are slightly spaced. You're on two different planes, not like you're on a tightrope. You're gonna turn sideways. Tuck that pelvis in, good posture. Okay, we'll put your hands on your hips and we're gonna sit here and breathe. Slowly, you can push that heel into the ground. Okay, 
That front knee can slowly bend. Try to keep your feet flat. And we're going to reach up. Now we're in warrior one. Deep breath in, open up, and now we're warrior two. Try to keep these arms at the same angle, and I'm facing forward towards my right foot. Breathe in, exhale, slowly turn to the other side. Warrior two, front, slight bend in that front leg, and breathe. Relax those shoulders. Hands exhale, hands to the waist. Bring that back in a little bit. Take that heel into the earth. Face forward. Couple breaths. And the heart over your hips. And we're going to go into warrior one. Spread those fingers out. Remember, slight bend in the front knee. And some breathing here, nice and easy. Now exhale. Arms drop down and back, back hips, and slowly turn. Great job. Going to warrior one and two. Now slowly walk those feet in, feet are together, hands on the hip, shoulders go up, and back. A couple breaths here, nice and easy. Bring that thumb to your heart. And one more breath. Now we always finish with our yoga with Namaste. Great job today, everybody. That is yoga for super beginners like myself. Thank you and great job.